in a small industrial estate, not so far from Exeter, uh, at the end of the alleyway, um, here's this unit, uh, not as nice or as beautiful or as picturesque as uh, dear old Riverside, but infinitely more practical in terms of being able to park vehicles, and this is the new studio. First thing you encounter as you come in is an older version of Pro Tools on an older G4 Max system. Uh, still extremely serviceable, yes. There is analog as well, folks, and it will be coming back fairly soon. And uh, here's some film music I'm working on. on a power Mac which is hidden under the table there and it's uh, some of the theme music for the film that I'm putting together of all my uh, tall ships exploits and this particular piece of music will um, be for all those ethereal wafty wafty type bits jolly uh, combination of MIDI pianos and wafty synthesizers and uh, real drums. Okay, in the booth there, uh, I've just been recording this morning with a local folk musician, Maggie Duffy. Um, and uh, so there's a couple of mics set up there in the booth, racks of ancient redundant equipment. Uh, God, anyone want one of those? Rourke drives, all kinds of uh, stuff that... Uh, trouble is you keep it all because, um, you know, every now and then, every two years, there's something in one of them that you actually want. And I'm one of these people who hates getting rid of things, but there you go. Make well our redundant computer equipment, the inevitable Audi guitar, yet another AW workstation. Today I'll be searching for percussion inspiration from the wonderful Manu Catch track. Blimey, I think he's done that before. These will be Jim Moray's old Fosdex uh, power monitors, uh, which are extremely nice, uh, linked up to the A&W at the moment. These are my lovely old B&Ws, which were uh, a hi-fi speaker, but the BBC had a special model which they used in small radio stations a long, long time ago. Bought these from Steve Fairholm of Otley, first of all fame. And I have two other pairs in case I blow these up. Uh, I'm just used to them. I love them. Um, oh my God. Oh dear, oh dear. All right, what happens in show of hands if you're stupid enough to leave your laptop uh, anywhere around in a dressing room, it will get sabotaged. But they've shot themselves in the foot this time because I've left it as my screensaver. Ha!